through your career, you are not thinking about, I want to become a legend. You just want to do better all the time. You want to put targets for everyday practice, for, for your career. You want to aim as high as possible. If that brings you to, to legend status, well, I'm, I'm very happy and very honored about that. A true legend in his own right. Peter Gader was one of the most dedicated and passionate shuttlers of his era. The Dane topped the world ranking from 1998 to 2001, won the All England Open in 1999, and was a five-time European champion. Gader spent some time with Badminton Unlimited, reflecting on his 17-year career and talking about the future of badminton, as well as his passion for the sport. You know, I grew up in a very, very small city in, in, in Denmark, and everything that mattered to me when I grew up was, was sports. Uh, in my case, uh, you know, I tried different sports, but mainly uh, football and badminton. They, they had a, a lot of interest for me. I wanted to wake up every day and play football, play badminton. I could do it for hours each day because, you know, the passion about competing, the passion about trying to do the strokes or the movements better and better and better, it was just a, like the most natural thing for me. Um, I remember growing up in this small city, very local environment, and people were asking me, uh, what do you want to do with this? And uh, I was very clear in my message, I want to go as, as far as possible, I want to become the best. And they were looking at me like, yeah, yeah good luck with that. Um, but. Um, I managed to, to go uh, all the way, I think, and uh, I did that because of uh, great termination, determination, but also, most importantly of all, the, you know, a passion for the game. When you grow up as a young player, you don't think about earning big money or uh, creating a life out of... Uh, you only think about, hey, if, if I could wake up every day and do my, my sport, my hobby, as my life, wow. I would, I would be lucky. Uh, that would be a dream. Once you set these dreams alive, you set this passion alive, there's, there's no looking back. If you reach one level, you want to go for the next one. If you win one big tournament, you want to go for the next one. There's always something you can do better. There's always something uh, you can achieve more. Since I quit my career in 2012, well, I think it was almost strange for me not to fight these battles uh, over and over. Uh, you kind of miss them. Hey, what, is, what is the next uh, mountain you have to climb? What is the next challenge you have to master? Um, so, of course, in, after badminton, you're going to have to set targets in, in other parts of your life. So I tried to do that, but it was kind of a really big transition. When I look back at my career, uh, what I miss the most it's not, it's not thinking about the big titles, it's not thinking about uh, uh, only the winning moments. Uh, of course, of course you, you treasure that, you remember that. But I, I think the, the, the everyday fire, the everyday passion for, for trying to push yourself is, is what I miss the most. I think we have to be very proud of, of our sport, of, of badminton. I think we can do a lot more things to bring out badminton as a global sport and not only popular in, uh, in badminton countries uh, in Asia, in Denmark. And, you know, we need to bring out badminton to a, to a wider audience to make it a global sport. And to do that, we, we need to do an, an effort uh, from the sport itself and, and from, from the, the big stars of the game.